Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was raised from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that control all of the earth, they leave their signs and secrets around us in symbolism. Even in these Google Doodles, on my channel we have been breaking these down for the last few years and they all show the an end time event coming, a great betrayal, just like when this Google Doodle of Martin Luther King Jr. for his birthday, just as he was betrayed and assassinated. In the Bible, it is the great head wound coming that happens to the USA and to even like the Vatican is supposed to be hit, the two Babylons of the end age and then a little horn rises up. Well this Google Doodle is celebrating Martin Luther King's birthday from January 15th 1929 where we're going to show how this symbolism is mixed right into the art in here. This doesn't have anything against Mr. King himself this is just they use him as an image with the name King and it will have all of the different reflections of the Bible even with the doves here of peace this will represent the rapture and also when peace is actually taken from the earth. In the Denver International Airport, the Freemasons have the end of the age mapped out. And this guy that represents the little horn in the end time scripture gets up and takes peace from the world. After a great head wound and a rapture, these people are raptured and then these people go off to basically like Nazi compounds coming back again for the great tribulation of the Bible that's coming out. Well I've shown this stuff all around the world and you can see right here this is Washington DC and I show how the whole earth is mapped out like a grid just like the old lines at the of the Nazca lines in Peru where everything could be seen from above the whole earth is being played out like a script and right here in Washington you can see the little horn rising up coming out of basically Pandora's box right here after a great event and then they make everybody take this check mark as the mark of the beast and they make you eat this little type of new host Eucharist that will actually blend the DNA we're going to show this right on this right on this Google Doodle right here some of this this is going to match this scripture Revelation 9 when the fifth angel sounded and he saw a star fall from heaven this is when the devil is cast out of heaven the accuser and he is on earth and has a short time and this is when the pit is open and the sun and air were darkened by reason of the smoke of the pit and this is when these are released, these beasts from the pit, and they had breastplates as it were breastplates of iron, and the sound of their wings was as the sound of chariots, of many horses running into battle. But right here is the key, and they had hair as the hair of women, and their teeth were as the teeth of lions. These are demon spirits being released. Well, let's show all of this right in there. Here we are right here. We could see that individual in there ready to come out. Well, let's do something here. Let's put this Google Doodle here. So here's the Google Doodle. Now, they've been showing the symbolism all around the world of Obama as the host for when he comes down. And this glyph it shows, you see in his hand here, is that new Eucharist being blended. You see the two sides being blended together, the reptile and the human DNA. In the book of Daniel it says they will blend the DNA together. Here it is, and it's all in the Bible to happen. Here comes that spiritual entity coming down, and he goes into Obama. And then he opens the pit with this nuclear event down near these two domes, which is down near Camp Pendleton, and the San Onofre power plant that has actually been turned off but is prepared for this day like a giant bomb. And right here you can see that this is when this phoenix rises. 
the rapture, just like the doves leaving by these two domes. And then Russia, the bear, rises up, the great betrayal, and they all rise up for the new world order coming. World War Three, if you will, all through there. Just as here. See the dove? And the people all sleeping like from the rapture. Well, right here, let's even show this here for the people that even watch like Harry Potter. They had a symbolism here of the Dark Lord coming down and being reawakened. And they kept showing like this man with the face on the back. And they've shown this before about Obama. Some people have seen this right here at that part. We can already see that why is Martin Luther King's hair blue and all the way down to his shoulders? Why? And then we can start to see in the back of his head here, we can actually see the alien right there, easily seen. That represents that alien coming down or the accuser being cast out of heaven. And then you can see the two domes. Here is the rapture and peace being taken away at the same time with the two O's. And then you have the darkness. See, these ones are dark. And for those that have really been following me, do you see the black goo again? Do you see how it's all like the black goo? A type of chemical infection coming that they keep showing? So there that is, right in the back of his head. You can see that. It's right there. Well, now we need one more thing. In our research, we've been showing like this entity, Coco, or Coca coming. A, just like this beast from the pit, Coco means skull. See some of these things? You can read some of this as you all want about this, folk, this folklore here, coming for vengeance and all upon the earth. Well, you see that? And then we saw about the beast with the long hair. Look at that. You can really see that right in there. Well, here's Coco. Here is the long hair right here. And you can even see the word Coco right there. Literally. There's the beast, all following scripture with the long hair. And then it even has the thing in its head. The coca. This thing that has terrible claws and tears and rends and destroys. It's a terrible thing from the pit. Confess with your mouth. The Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart. God hath risen him from the dead. And you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Thank you very much everybody. Everything continues to just be verified over and over again exactly as we keep showing the end of days will come. We don't know the hour. And may the Lord Jesus Christ keep granting us mercy. There it is right there. You can see that thing right in his head. Perfect. And then with the coca coming. The two domes. Peace and the rapture leaving at the same time. And then we can even see the black goo. And for this symbolism about Abraham Lincoln, he's on the $5 bill. And that means we are nearing the fifth age. And in the fifth age in the book of Daniel is when they blend the DNA together. Just as right here, this new host comes down in the book of Daniel, right there. Thank you very much, everybody. Everything's been verified over and over again. Whoops. There we go, right there. That thing in his head. And the coca coming. May the Lord Jesus Christ keep granting us mercy. Hallelujah.